But I like okay, okay. Can, Videl, can I just take a second to like to like make make this public service announcement this right quick, like some real talk? Okay, so like um Videl and I like we go to Sun Alliance Studio, right? And like, you know, every once in a while, like I like to V- Videl like you know likes to sometimes keep to himself when he's at the studio, but like me, I interact with like you know all the all the people there, all the dudes there, and everything. And sometimes we we'll do like little ciphers and we we'll, like freestyle together, okay? And we we'll just spit. And sometimes there'll be like younger kids there, you know what I'm saying? Like thirteen, fourteen year old kids. Sometimes like eight, even eight, nine year old kids. And we we'll just kick it. And we we'll just take turns freestyling, okay? And when I hear some of the lyrics like those kids like say, like they always talk about every time when you hear the kids rap, they talk about shooting up people, you know what I'm saying, getting stripes in the streets, you know what I'm saying, talking about slanging drugs, talking about like stealing your chick, blah blah blah. Like things like that. You know what I'm saying? And that that just really makes me super sad, super duper sad. Cause like these are kids, you know what I'm saying? And they don't they don't know any better, but they're receiving all of those messages from us. This generation, they look up to us. They, 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 they see us rapping about these type of things. Like, oh, okay, this these type of things is cool. So for us to get credibility, for us to be respected in this circle, we got to spit about that type of stuff. And that's completely and absolutely not true. You know what I'm saying? So we as artists, you know what I'm saying, who's on the radio, as artists, who's making local music, we got to be a better example for these children. You know what I'm saying? For the next generation. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I'm doing out here with like IB Life and everything. And this song that Videl and I, we're putting out called Do You. We're going to like, we're going to tell kids how to like, you know, just be themselves and be comfortable like in your own skin and things like that. Because there's too much bullshit in hip hop, man. Excuse my language. Too much crap, man. Like there's too much just people in the streets. Okay. And I understand that, you know, if, if you do live that life you're in the streets you got to talk about it right but there's two ways to talk about it there's two perspectives there's one way you could talk about it in such a way that you're saying okay these this stuff is happening in the streets it's so messed up this is bad somebody come fix it right now you know what i'm saying we hate living this lifestyle it's crazy you could talk about it like that and, and kids they're gonna they're gonna listen to that and they're gonna be like okay this ain't cool you know what i'm saying we're gonna grow up we're gonna do something to fix it and then you end up with people like so Baz and lindell and l right you end up with those type of people or you could you could talk about this thing, this whole street thing, in like a glorifying type of way, and like, oh man, this is so cool. I'm shooting people up. I'm a real OG, double triple killer. Got freaking tears tatted on my face. You know what I'm saying? I don't give a fuck. I'm in the streets. You know what I'm saying? Anybody trying to mess with me? You know what I'm saying? You getting capped? You getting dropped? You know what I'm saying? That's real talk on the concrete. And if you talk about it like that. Kids are going to emulate that. Kids are going to copy that. They're going to think all that street stuff is cool. Trust me, violence ain't cool. You know what I'm saying? I got homeboys who are shooters. I got homeboys that got stabbed before. I got homeboys, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's, it's, it's not cool. Violence is not cool, straight up. And us as rappers, okay, especially those rappers like that are like me, you know what I'm saying, who don't do that type of stuff, stop rapping about it, man. Just stop. And even if you are going to rap about it, rap about it in such a way that, you're 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 condemning it. Don't don't make it sound like it's the is 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 the ish. You know what I'm saying? Don't make it sound so great. Like stop it. Like straight up. Like it shouldn't be me telling y'all this. You know what I'm saying? Because hip hop is like a, is like a is like a predominantly black culture, right? So and like you got you got an Asian man out here talk talking about it. Like it shouldn't even be me talking about it. But I just see so much of it and it's just so messed up. I just have to talk about it. You know what I'm saying? And it's this is how it is, unfortunately. And like rappers in the mainstream right now, Drake, Nicki, and 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 and, and Lil Wayne. Like we we talk, we talk about this often. Nicki's song, the like Anaconda, and you know their their song, um, the the one that just came out only. Like it's so much garbage, man. It's such garbage. It's all about it's it's about smashing and Nicki's butt. The whole song is about Nicki's butt and how much Drake wants to smash and how he's the next man in line and Lil Wayne is jumping the line and he wants to smash. That's what the whole song is about. Like. Ugh. You know what I'm saying? Like, listen to more people like Drake, like like J. Cole, like Kendrick, like Nas, like Pac. Go listen to those guys. Stop listening to like this bullcrap that's on like radio waves right now, man. Like, serious. Okay, that's 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 my rant for today, man. I'm done. Videl, let's let's get back to get back to the show. Thanks, bro. Like, I'm not, I'm not even looking for no applause. I don't want no applause. Well, I don't but, uh, but it's true what you say. I just, I just want to say, man. Hey, straight up. Like us, we uh, rappers out here in the local scene. I'm gonna put you guys on. Videl and I, we're gonna put you on. But please be responsible with this, cause this is power. You know what I'm saying? This is radio. This is power. People can tune in to 88.1 like whenever they want. Okay. And if we're gonna play your music on the radio, you know what I'm saying? Make sure it's it's no bullshit that it's just gonna mess kids' minds up. 
And this is not this is not a diss to my homie Charisma. This is not a diss to my homies from SMG. This is not a diss to all the rappers out here that do make that type of music. But I'm just saying, you know what I'm saying? Us, as the older generation, let's just be more aware and let's be more responsible.